Hi, Petrini Han here, your go-to girl for learning how to make fit work in a crazy busy world. And today I'm going to answer one of the most frequently asked questions I get, and that is, which Shakeology flavor tastes the best? Or which Shakeology flavor should I get with my challenge pack? If you're one of the people who are chronically indecisive and you just have no clue which flavor to pick, be sure to stay tuned. First things first, if you're someone who loves chocolate like me, it's a no-brainer. You're going to pick a chocolate flavor. We have two different versions of chocolate. There is the regular whey-based chocolate and the vegan chocolate. If you're someone who likes a thicker and creamier shake, I would say go with the whey version. You can't go wrong that way. If you like thinner shakes or if you are vegan or vegetarian, you can pick the vegan chocolate shakeology. My personal preference between the two is the vegan chocolate, but that's because I like my shakes a little bit thinner. If strawberry is more your thing, pick a strawberry. And again, we have two different flavors, the whey-based strawberry and the vegan tropical strawberry. Again, I think there is a difference in texture, so if you do like richer, creamier shakes, get the whey-based. If you like thinner shakes, go for the vegan version. I will say too that if you are someone who likes tropical kind of drinks, go for the, the vegan version because it is less of a pure strawberry taste. You're gonna get you know mango and pineapple in there, whereas the whey base is a pure strawberry. Another flavor option if you like a lot of variety in your shakes and you want to try it in a number of different ways, I think vanilla is the most versatile out of all six flavors. You can really do a lot with vanilla. My personal favorite way to make it as a, is as a pina colada or an orange creamsicle. I like it when it's, it's mixed with some sort of citrus. I think it tastes the best that way. And last but not least, you may have heard some very, very bad things about our misunderstood friend, the green berry flavor. And you know, to be honest, when, when I first tried this in its original version, they've, they've since completely revamped it. I called it green death. I hated it. I thought it tasted like grass picked from part of lawn. It was, it was horrible. I'll be honest, I was not a big fan of green berry. But since they revamped it, it is actually one of my favorite flavors now. I love it. I would liken it to the taste of crunch berry cereal, it, it, which is hard to describe, but it tastes like, you know, the milk you had left over when you were having crunch berry cereal. And that was one of my favorites as a kid, so that's probably why it has become one of my favorites. It's actually nothing to be afraid of. Don't, don't shy away from the green berry. And that's my little recap of each of the flavors and how they're going to taste. If you are debating between buying a box of single serve packets or a bag, if you want to get the most bang for your buck, opt for the bag. You're going to get about 30 servings in a bag, whereas if you get the single serve packets, you get 24 servings. So you get more for the money since they are both the same price. If you are someone who is signing up as a coach with a challenge pack, which is a great way to sign up as a coach, I would say to maybe get the box instead because that way you can use the single serve packets to give the samples if you have friends who want to try it before they buy it from you. And regardless of whether or not you're signing up as a coach or as a customer, I always recommend if you are someone who is in the market for Shakeology to just go ahead and get what's called a challenge pack because then you will get Shakeology and a home workout program bundled together at a ridiculously low price. That's the best way to go and if you have any questions about which challenge pack you should choose and what program is right for you, feel free to shoot me an email at coachvetrina at yahoo.com. You can check out my very easy, sexy, cool website over at vetrinahamfitness.com or if you want, you can go ahead and just sign up for free fitness coaching with me at makefitwork.com. That's it. Take care. Bye-bye.